Hello, good morning, HTC family and YouTubers. I was just watching Kevin Yee's video. He's um, another HTC family member. I don't think I've met him yet, but I loved his video and it brought me to tears. Um, you know, I think back to my journey in season four when I joined HTC, uh, Dan Locke's program and for me, at the beginning, I didn't join the Facebook group till a bit later, and also, you know, I wasn't that resourceful. I realized that, you know, through my journey after season four as well, uh, joining a real closing team, they were called Team Live Rich, and I realized when I failed the trial run that and, and I asked myself, why am I not resourceful? I looked deep within and I realized that the way I'd grown up and I might still be surrounded by some of the same people right now, even though I've gone through HDC. Um, but yeah, you, you know, being unresourceful, um, I've realized that kept me inside of my job for that bit longer so I, w I would say that going through HTC that's going to depend on what you're going to put in are you going to be resourceful well, the trouble is I think if I'd been unresourceful the way I'd been conditioned I've been conditioned like by society like everyone relies on somebody for something like uh Maybe your girlfriend relies on you for a bit of affection. She's kind of the needy sort. Sorry, I was just flicking the, the thing. Um, I was just flicking away the Discord. Yeah. Um, so with a story I'm going to share, is that, like I say, I mean, through season four, I think it was eventually that I joined the Facebook group through somebody I was role playing with, um, Australian guy, and um, I tell you what, I subscribed to Dan's channel before I'd actually joined the Facebook group. That's just that's on my personal YouTube profile. If you look up Will Carr, it's the one with the boat. Um, yeah, and uh, before I even got into HDC. Yeah, my friend actually, you know, so sort of closed me into it. I know that it's not many details that I've even revealed with anybody else, not even my own friends, that um, I did take out Garrett to the loan to help my friend out. Um, so, still, I may be in a bit of debt, but thankfully, as I went through the whole HTC journey, I know you've seen me make some other videos as well. Um, do you know what I've even realized? Because there were times when, um, I know like recently I made some, a couple of months back. I was trying to campaign for the affiliate program. Um, so I know after the course, that you, you can you can do that if you want to, but not everybody has to. Um, and you know, this time, I'm not here to try and hard sell any of you to come and join HDC. And I know I wasn't as successful as like Kevin Yee or anybody else there. Uh, um, but right now, I'm in a closing team, Breakthrough Closers, with a guy called Chris Gambra and we've and I'm their ninth member currently. Um and we are about to be closing for somebody at the moment. So if you're watching this link right now, I can't guarantee that Chris might accept you in the team, but you know and I don't know if I'm gonna have my own team in about a couple of weeks or where I'm gonna be but who knows if you 
if you decide that you want to join HTC, I'll be there every step of the way to mentor you because I want you to succeed. I will teach you how to be resourceful. And I know that right now, you know, I may be stuck in my JOV, but I'm so close to getting out because my team have found an opportunity. So I could be closing for a singer, nonetheless, woman queen of fear at some point. Um, yeah, and you know, so I feel absolutely just happy that I am one step close. I might not have made the first sale yet. Do you know, I'll tell you what, when I thought I made my first sale in Team Live Rich, you know, the most funny thing was that I, I realised that I thought I'd close the guy, <clears throat> but actually no payment had even gone through. You know, and I thought that seems that seems really weird because surely if he said he was rolling, it's going through. But I think learning from that mistake, you know, that mistake has now cost me to be in my job like a little bit longer. And um, you know, I think of some of the things that I didn't implement so much because at first, you know. Even getting in. And before I actually joined, I was a bit like, nah, this this can't be real. This, this high income school, Dan Lock, where you're on the phone, you make so much money. But yeah, here I am. So close to getting out of my J-O-B. I'm happy about that. That I'm going to enter into the Garden of Abundance. And, you know, you can choose to stay in your life right now. I'm not here to force you to come and join HDC with me. I'm not going to save you if you don't want to be saved. If you're swimming towards me, I will save you. So if you like this video and you feel that I'm delivering some value here, just subscribe. Like you are smashing a thousand dollars on a fucking table in front of your mum and dad. Just imagine that. Imagine if you could smash one thousand dollars on the table. And I'm not here to guarantee that you're gonna get results. You just have to be resourceful. You just gotta show me that you can teach yourself to be resourceful. I'm teaching myself that. I'm teaching myself how to get up early in the fucking morning. Because, you know, since I joined the Breakthrough Closers, I've noticed that I'm actually connecting more with the HDC family. I, I love this family. They're the fucking best family in the world. <laughs> you know what? And I just cried after watching Kevin use Vic. <laughs> the best fucking thing in the world and I can't believe that right now I'm crying in front of a fucking million viewers I'll tell you why I want to get out of my JV because those corrupt fuckers have used me all these years to do their hours. And I realize, why am I still there? You know? I mean, to make a video, it shows that I respect myself and I hate those bastards. And for legal reasons, I'm not gonna mention them in case they fucking sue my ass. But I don't care. When I leave them, I'm gonna fucking mention their name. I will. I'll mention their name to the whole fucking world. I will expose them to the whole of YouTube when I leave. And I will burn their uniform in front of a fucking camera when I leave them. It will be the most gracious, 